Hi guys, I'm back with the Gel Polish Mini. So Madam Glam had allowed me to pick out four gel polishes, and so I'm just unboxing those here. Nice um, gel polishes. These four colors are from Madam Glam's Spring Has Sprung Bundle. It's a collaboration with Sandra Garcia. Um, and so these are the colors. The first one is Frida, which is a nice pink, hot pink. So I'm just showing you the swatch stick because I did swatch with Madam Glam's base coat, two coats of color, and their no wipe top coat. The next color that we have is Besame. And this is a nice turquoise blue. Very, very pretty. Now I love blue all shades. Um, the lighter shades are my favorite, but I do think like that vibrant royal blue is my favorite color or shade of blue. The next color is Vida Loca. This is a nice light purple, almost lavender, but not quite light enough in my opinion um, to be considered lavender. It's a purple cream color. Again, I think all of these colors looked great against my skin tone. And the last co color is Mi Taco is Mi Taco, which is a nice cream orange color. Okay, so guys, we're gonna get into this application, of course. The color that I chose to do a mani with is Besame. And so it is a nice vibrant blue. I do have on a peel-off base coat on top of my Builder Gel, which I always keep on my nails. And so gel polishes can be applied on top of Builder Gel, just like they could be applied on top of Poly Gel or acrylic nails or your natural nail. Um, so I'm applying a thin layer of base coat and I will cure in my LED lamp for 30 seconds. Madam Glam's gel polishes are HEMA free, 21 free, cruelty free, palm oil free, um, along with some other things. Um, and so after that, I'm going to use the two colors, Besame, and I think the white is dancing in the snow. I purchased that color with my own money. And so with Madam Glam, they do have a VIP membership program where you pay $29 a month and you receive a $29 credit that never expires. You can kind of like a savings program for your gel polish. If not, you can select the pay-as-you-go option. I do have a discount code, but the bit.ly link in my description box will... Um, take you directly to the site and apply that code is for 30 percent off and so yeah just hang out with me while i do this application i do apply two coats of color curing for 30 seconds in between each coat
After I get that second coat of polish cured, I'm gonna go in with some water decals because I cannot leave my nails plain, just not me. And so I do have some plaid decals from Poshy Nail Designs. This is plaid is the new fad number four. And so I thought the colors, um, the Besame went well with that plaid color. And so with Poshy Nail Designs, they come with extra, so I do love the extra. So I do, I, and that's what I used. I cut those out, sprayed them with water, and then I'm going to wait. While I wait for the water to do its job with releasing the decal, I'm going to go in and apply base coat and cure for 30 seconds in my LED lamp. And that's just because I want a fresh a coat of base that will give me a nice fresh inhibition layer even though the white cures with the inhibition layer I want the tackiness from the base coat you don't have to do that but I think it's just best to do it so after I cure for 30 seconds um, by that time the decal is ready to be released from the paper I'm going to remove excess water from the decal per my normal method with a lint free towel paper towel whatever you want to use pick that up with my nail stamper this is the Poshy Nail Design nail stamper and I'm going to place that on my nail and smooth that out as much as possible I did end up ripping the decal because they're really thin and delicate um, and I just pushed it back together <laughs> and it seemed to be a okay and so I'm going to repeat that for my um, index finger and that's just the decal cutter tool it really doesn't cut the decal but it kind of helps seal it along the side walls and cuticle area and so I'm going to repeat that for my ring finger not ring finger my index finger doing the same thing and then off camera I will use acetone and a nail brush to remove any excess decal from the cuticle area on the side walls and the free edge of my nail and then I'm going to apply a layer of base coat and cure for 30 seconds and then I'll go on with top coat and cure for 30 seconds after I get that excess cleaned up I don't know what happened there but um just a lot going on and so after I get that cleaned up and cure for 30 seconds I wait and then I'm going to go in with Madame Glam's elixir which is their cuticle oil and apply that to my nails so guys please like this video if you found value and you like the mani that was created really simple leave a comment let me know what you think and subscribe to my channel it is free in 2023 why not so i hope you guys have a wonderful week and i'll see you next time thank you so much for watching Thank you.